adding multiple linking systems to the same particles adds up much more delicacy to the animation. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to make more complex animations using particles link add-on. First, as usual, let's delete the default cube and add a sphere for the sake of much more explosive effects for the particles and delete the lower half in the particles tab add particle system and in the field weights disable the gravity and increase the velocity to 2 now let's add another sphere as the particles object but with a smaller size and select the particles and in the render tab select object and the new sphere and change the scale to 0.5 Now we are ready to link them using the link particles link add-on. Press N for the side panel and the IKPL tab. Press link active. And change the mode to network mode. And to give it some thickness, I need a bevel object, so by right shift click. Way. I, I move the 3D cursor and create a new Bezier circle and select the links and select this Bezier circle as my bevel object but it's, it's too big so I need to scale it in edit mode And to fine tune it, I can edit the curve shape. I think this thickness is good for us. Uh, let me give it a material to make it more distinguishable and change the viewport color to black. Now select my, I select my particles and add new link system and again change the mode to network and select the same bevel object but this time I will clip the bevel object to make it 0.1 and give it a new material well, let, it, let it be change the viewport color to red and to triple the fun let's add new linking system by make link active and again select the same Bezier circle and change the mode to network and clip it, add the clip start, change the value to 0.9 and give it another lovely material. Now we have three linking systems to the same particles. To make my particles ready for rendering, I need to select each of them and press bake this is the final animation after playing a bit with materials camera movement and depth of field feel free to ask any questions in the comments and see you in the next lesson